Hello everyone and welcome back. It's your buddy Isaac. And today's video is brought to you in part with our partners at Ubisoft who gave me this game. I hope you guys are ready to do this. I am ready to do this. We're going to be playing some more Assassin's Creed, but today it is Assassin's Creed. Video. I am ready to do this. We're going to be playing some more Assassin's Creed, but today it is Assassin's at Ubisoft who gave me this game. I hope you guys are ready to do this. I am ready to do this. We're going to be playing some more Assassin's Creed, but today it is Assassin's Creed VR. Sorry if it's a little stretched out. Um, everything records like phone level, so it is what it is. So I hope you guys are ready for this. I'm psyched. I love this uh right i'll be right back all right we're back we're connected we're ready to go so again i want to get let you guys know this uh, ow my arm is hurting <laughs> it hurts it sucks but this game was provided to me by ubisoft through their creator program free of charge you can pick this up in your obviously in your meta quest store you can pick it up anywhere uh, for your MetaQuest 2, 3, for centuries, the Brotherhood of Assassins of the Templar have defended free will versus social societal control. An elite Brotherhood hacker sent undercover to work for a Stavro of the Templar's modern day front. You will learn the Templar 10 influencing society through their beliefs. Stopping that plan is up to you. Cool. What? Hello. Testing, testing. One, two, three. That'll do. Hello there. Thanks for hey. taking our call. I'm Sean, and this is Rebecca. Hi, Sean. You're your brotherhood contacts with the Hi, Rebecca. What's the job? Straight to the point. I like that. Bex? Our intelligence indicates Abstergo is developing a new profiling technology that goes way beyond anything seen before. Yes, that's my little over altar years, to the gods over there, by the way. Archived the memories Sorry for the mess, if you can see all this. I live in a tiny a studio, like Mark. That's what I can afford. I don't think I'd call you normal, Sean. Very funny, but the point is, imagine if your own memories could be analyzed to understand how you think, to learn about your values and beliefs and to know what to show or tell you online or in person to slowly replace Sounds like those the Google beliefs. algorithm <laughs> Templar beliefs So where do I come in? The executive in charge of this initiative Dominica Wilk needs someone with your skills to finish the project but she doesn't know you're working for us or that you're going to shut her operation down for good But more on that later For now, we'll piggyback on your connection so we'll be there when you need us. You'll have to switch over from our network to Abstergo's, and then you're off to your first meeting with your new boss. Oh, man, why did I do this while my arm is hurting? Oh, not the smartest idea of the planet. Huh, what have we here? The heck? Our friend is one step ahead of us. That will sever their connection to our virtual space when they connect to Abstergo and Dominica and let us listen in on their conversations safely. Uh, 
I'm confused. Oh, okay. I see what we're doing here. Yeah. No. Um. Okay. It looks like you'll need to align the nodes to match the pattern. Okay, cool. Oh, okay. Come here. You. Slot there. You. Slot there. Don't forget, you work. Uh, Sean? Guys? Ah, you must be the hacker. As ordered. Good. I'm Dominica Wilk. You'll report to me. Hi, lady. Your skills are impressive, and so is your track record. Hacking governments, multinationals. Whatever you want, I can get it. That's why I hired you. <laughs> but this job is different. This is the Abstergo Cloud. It's an archive of memories stretching back through time. We use a technology called the Animus to visit these memories, seeing them through the eyes of those who lived them. What is this, time travel? It's a simulation. No action you take in the Animus can directly affect the present. Hmm. So why do you need me? The memories in the cloud hold the key to an important project I'm working on. So I want you to visit these memories and bring back the information I need. Where do I start? It's more of a who than a where. Ezio Auditore di Firenze. Ezio! And master assassin. Sounds like quite a character. He was. Ezio was friends with Leonardo da Vinci and Machiavelli and a sworn enemy of the Borgias. He touched many lives at the end of the 15th century. And his blade ended more than a few. Count me in. Not so fast. The Animus is unlike anything you've ever experienced before. So we need to get you acclimated to its use. Think of it as a test before we set you loose on the real deal. Now, let's see what you've got. Ezio Auditore! Amico! You have experience with VR games? Yes! Uh, have you played any VR games where you can use or move around using the controller? Yes! You experience VR sickness? No. Not that I've ever noticed. Cool. Huh, they have a fear of heights mode. That's interesting. Uh Where am I? It's dark and I have headphones on. Because <laughs> when I do this, I actually have a set of headphones with a mic that I attach. Uh, help. Oh, it's saving. Hi. Hi, little saving thing. Um. Welcome to the Animus Orientation Protocol. I will guide you through the basics of using the Animus. Your avatar is now active. You should be able to move around freely. Uh, ha -ha. Whack! 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 Nice! Cool! I'm old! Bunk! Bunk! Once again, my path leads back to Venice. 
Alas, I must deny my friends here the pleasure of my company. I have a sword to retrieve, and a lesson to teach. No one steals from an auditore and leaves to boast about it. Cool. I wish we were with the rest of the troop right now, instead of being stuck standing guard here. Why? They're working hard out there in the countryside. All we have to do is watch an empty building and drink wine. They'll be getting plenty of chances to wind their pockets when the day comes. We'll be getting our reward here. I'd better be careful here. You must make your way through the library without being detected. If you're spotted, you'll desynchronize and will restart from your last checkpoint in this memory. What have we here? I really was looking forward to the chance to do a little, shall we say, acquisitions work. Why are you in such a rush? I have bills to pay. They won't give me credit down at the wine shop. <laughs> You can distract guards in a number of ways. For example, you can divert their attention by throwing objects to make noise. What's making that noise? What's this? Fun. That was a waste of time. Have fun! <laughs> if you feel uncomfortable when using the Animus, remember that you can adjust your comfort settings at any time. You are now going to learn how to assassinate a target. Flick your wrist outward while holding the trigger button to draw your hidden blade. Once the blade is drawn, you can use it to assassinate your unsuspecting right up the target. Button. Well done. You have mastered the art of assassination. Now proceed with your mission. I'm not supposed to be here. Oh. The Animus Pulse ability detects key objects nearby and highlights them with a gold aura. There is an empty socket above the fireplace. There's nothing in here! <laughs> hmm. Uh, oh, come here. I'm here. Oh, come on. Hmm. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> I'm liking this already. Eh. Whacking my head against my bed there. Or my hand against the bed. Alright. Hello. Okay. So it won't let me go that way. Hmm. Down we go, it looks like. Let's 
seems I was a little too eager to parkour. A dead end. But there is always a way out. What is this? Hmm. I must be missing something. So we need the other half. Hello. Hey, it's Leonardo's bird. Something valuable, at least. Two pieces joined together. But where do they go? By on the fireplace, probably. Nope, nope, nope. Get back here. Get back here. Ooh. Secret passage. But of course. Quickly, I must leave the city tonight. Yes, mistress. To reach the next room, you will need to climb this wall. Try it now. Already on it. What is this? A treasure room of some kind? My sword could well be here. Hmm. Times. I am glad we dress more sensibly these days. <laughs> sure about that? Hey, look, a mace. Just. Hmm. <laughs> Frisbee! <laughs> no. Sorry, I'm having too much fun. My sword must be here somewhere. Hey, it's Venezia! <sighs> Do it to -do. Do -do -do. You're coming. An elegant blade. Ha! Ha! He stabby, stabby. Why does it have to be on this side? Whatever. Sweep. Sweet. <laughs> a note. The sword is attractive, but ultimately useless for our purposes. It is not the item we need. We must plan more carefully and try again. There is no signature. Hmm. Well then. Let us burn it. Oh? Escape the palazzo. Oh. Now initiating the Animus combat protocol. Loading standard enemy profile. Block the incoming strikes by holding your weapon to intercept them. Take that! Havazzi! I'll be the end of you! 
strike insufficient to cause damage. Your strikes are not effective. Excellent. Now block a sequence of strikes. Wait for the right moment to strike. Blocking enemy attacks can create opportunities for you to strike. Block the following attack sequence to continue. Blocking a series of enemy attacks opens up windows to strike. Use these chances to slash an enemy. I am slashing! Execution rated acceptable. Now perform the maneuver in real time. A well-placed attack will stun an enemy. This will allow you to strike and cause increased damage. Performance rated acceptable. Now eliminate Come. this enemy. Anubis awaits you. You're as good as dead! Your training rated a success. Terminating Animus Combat Protocol. Looking at enemies will tag them. So you can track them when they're out of sight. Father had discarded, but there is always a way through. Well, of course, only the fool touches the ground if they have to. They don't need to. That's just not fair. <laughs> hmm. That's not fair, forcing me to walk on the ground.
Let's see what you're made of. me to play a certain way? Fine. The sword is my game, but my heart is not yet at ease. I will make for Monterey Johnny. It is time I went home. <laughs> Enjoy. Welcome, my friends. For your first time in the Animus, I'm a quick study. I'll let <laughs> me take the training wheels off. Certainly, but first, you need to know why you're here. We call it the Antikythera Mechanism. It was found a hundred years ago in a shipwreck off the coast of Greece. What is it? It's part of an ancient computer, older than recorded history. We think it was used for prognostication, predicting the future. So, who <laughs> built it? We believe it predates human civilization. Though what's important is that within this device is code more advanced than any we've seen before. We reverse engineered it so it can interface with the Animus, but that's just the start. I'm listening. The Antikythera mechanism is one part of a much larger machine, broken apart in the distant past. With the code from those missing fragments, we can bring the old and the new together and create a computer more powerful than we've seen before. Yeah, um, there's the a little thing. Fine. And now you're a part of it. A little thing about that, lady. Uh, just friends. because you can do Give something doesn't past. mean you should. And that's where you come mm. in. I need you to visit the memories within the Abstergo cloud, find the missing fragments, and extract the code contained within them. Are you asking me to search the whole cloud? No, we've identified a series of memories as linked to the missing fragments. You'll place tracking beacons within them to triangulate your position within the memory clusters and direct us towards those most likely to contain what we're looking for. Do I stay with that, CEO? For now, but in time you'll visit other memories. We'll have to see where the search leads. I'll be watching your progress. Good luck. Okay. Looks like you'll need to align the nodes to match the pattern.
Hello. Ooh, she'll be watching. Scary. Hi, guys. You've heard what she had to say. Now remind me what you want from me. Just what we hired you to do. Use your skills to help us stop them. Now before you dive into the past, let's have a quick brief. As Dominica said, you're going to be planting beacons and memories to try to zoom in on these fragments she's after. But, thanks to you, we've got a little surprise for her. Now, this particular bit of code you whipped up is one of the neatest logic bombs I've ever seen. It's going to fit undetectably inside the beacons. Plant a beacon, and you'll be planting a bomb, too. And when all the logic bombs have been placed, we'll trigger them and they'll devour the memories you've visited. Abstergo will no longer have access to their content. Right, time to go. Enjoy the uh, Italian countryside. Have some pasta. And please be careful. Cool. It's funny, so I'm actually quarter Sicilian? <laughs> Alright, well, I think, guys, this is going to be it for now. I don't want to make this too long. But again, thank you to our partners at Ubisoft for giving us this game. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll do be more doing more videos of this. And I'll see you next time.